Hello and welcome back to TCG Dreamland. Bada bing, bada boom. Box number 10. I think. Hopefully. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is box number 10. So, getting down to the last few. Still have not gotten the alt arts of Ryudamon, uh, Ophanamon, or Magnamon. Those are the three I'm really looking for. Because they're the top three in the set. Honestly, you know, once you get to a certain point, once you've pulled, like, the highest ones in the set, then it's no problem just buying the singles of the others. But I would really like to actually pull, you know, the top three cards in the set, which are the three alt arts that I haven't pulled yet. So let's get to it. Let me move this light a little bit. All right, that looks pretty good. I haven't asked this in a while. Let me know what you think about my whole setup here. Is the is the lighting good? Do you think the background could be better? Do you think the camera angle could be better? I kind of like this angle. Climb on. Ooh, starting off with a Davis. That's pretty nice. Yeah, let me know what you think. I always, I mean, the channel's super new, so I'll always take constructive criticism, you know, with uh, emphasis on constructive, you know, don't just be mean. So, uh, yeah, let me know what you think about my setup. If there is there stuff that other YouTubers do that you think would improve my whole situation here? Is the lighting good? Is the background good? Right, skipping all the commons, going right to Terriermon, then Black Gatomon, card that I can't pronounce, super cool samurai dragon, and then we've got a Yukio and Bancho Mamemon. Demi Marimon, Hawkmon, Yole, and Digmon. Still have not gotten the Kari box topper. That would be very interesting if this whole case didn't have a Kari box topper. I've gotten several of the Davis. I've gotten like three of the Davis box topper, but none of the Kari box topper. Watch, it'll be the last box that I open. It'll be the 12th out of 12 boxes that has the Kari box topper. And that'll actually complete all of the box toppers. We've got Digmon and Malomyotismon for our first super rare. That one will go about there. All right, we've got Bibimon, Plasma Shot, Meta Knight, Myotismon, and Chimera Mon. Very nice super rare. I think this is, of the regular super rares, I think this one is the most expensive. It's a very good card. You have to build your deck around it. You have to have a rainbow deck to be able to have its abilities work so their full potential. All right, Cyclone Mon, Gamma Mon, and Oryu Mon, back-to-back -back super rares. That one's not bad, actually. All right, Dino Humon. I'm gonna go with that. Rasenmon, Fury Mode, Guramon, I've got the Black Agumon, and a Sylphimon. All right. 
right, scratch my eyebrow real quick. We've got Crimson Blaze, Kari, Samadhi Santi, got Ryudamon and the Alter Ryudamon. Nope, it's a Zhu Chaomon. So that brings us to four hits, four super rares, no alt arts yet. Hoping we can get some more double alt art boxes because I've gotten multiple of both of the regular secret rares so far. So hopefully we can get some more double alt art boxes. I think we've, we might have only gotten, no, I think we've gotten two double alt art boxes. All the others have had one alt art and one secret rare. Lydramon, very nice rare there. And a Davis, once again, these two cards coming together in the same pack. That happens a lot more frequently than you would think. I'd say most boxes have had a pack with both of those in the same pack. what I say? This is our 10th box. We've probably had at least eight of the boxes have had a pack with both of those rares in the same pack. Gammon and Dark Gaia Force with a huge... Death Orb. Really like that artwork. All right, square that up. We've got Kari. Halsamon. The Griffin with the Blade Helmet. And Creepy Mon Secret Rare. I'll take it, I guess. I wanted double alt arts, but... That's okay. I think that might be my third regular Creepy Mon. All right, Demi Devimon, Terrier Mon, Digimon Emperor, Magnamon, there you go. There's one of the super rares that you do want to see. So we are up to six hits. Still two more hits needed, including our alt art. Really hoping it's not a duplicate. Oh, Phantom on fall down mode, I'll take it. That one's not bad. It's actually looking at it, that's the correct place for it. In terms of monetary value. We have Submarimon, Crimson Blaze, Digimon Emperor yet again, and a Flame Hell Scythe. All right, Innocence Blizzard, Kyokyomon, Frost Velgermon, the old Ice Peacock, and a Climbmon. There's still a few packs left. Right to the Black Gatomon, Shuramon, Flamedramon. It's pretty cool. And we've got, oh, nice! This is one of the alt arts we needed. Magnamon. This is the second highest card in the set. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Fantastic. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put that in the back there. Move those boxes a little closer. Better angle. There we go. Magnamon Altar. Ladies, you know what? I was talking about the, uh, the pattern. Oh, that's interesting. The, uh... The way that you can tell it's an alt art, or at least the easiest way you can tell, aside from just knowing what the alt art, the art looks like, is that these are all textured, and all of the alt arts, well, I'm not sure about all of them, but most of them, at least all the ones that I remember, have different texturing. So this one's just kind of, uh, I don't know, it doesn't look like any kind of named pattern that I can think of. Hmm. 
Hmm, just kind of hash marks all over the thing. Interesting. If you remember from our last box, our alt art had a kind of a starburst pattern coming from behind the Mon. All right, we've got TK, Mars Mon, card I can't pronounce, Myotis Mon, and a Metal Gray Mon. Not bad at all. We've got four packs left. And four packs, we could get a hit. We could, this could be a nine hit box. So, yeah, that Magnamon alt art definitely makes up for the Creepy Mon. So, Flame Dramon and Azulong Mon. So, this went from a not so great box, kind of mad box, to a wow, this, this actually. Turned out to be quite a profitable box, actually. Of course, I'm not selling the expensive alt arts. I'm keeping them for my collection. Oh, that's cool. We got the Metal Greymon right into the Black War Greymon. That is, in fact, our ninth hit. Very nice. Two packs left. All right, so these... Unfortunately, probably don't have anything in them. So we'll just go through them real quick. All right, it has Hero and another Metal Greymon. So very nice. Yeah, I'd say overall that Chimeramon is quite expensive, Magnamon. And then also, oh, this is another thing that's interesting. So in the last box, we had the, uh, what's it called? Rapidmon. So we had the Rapidmon with the Rapidmon alt art. And then in this box, we had Magnamon and Magnamon alt art in the same box. Not sure if that's like a thing or not. It's probably just coincidence. I mean, we've gotten lots of Magnamons in boxes before. It's probably just coincidence that we got Magnamon and the Magnamon alt art. And then in the last box, we had Rapidmon and Rapidmon alt art. But look at that. Very cool. It's kind of an interesting coincidence. So that was a really nice box. That The, the two Magnamons together basically pay for the box. So <laughs> very happy with that box. Uh, we have two left. So if you want to see those, make sure to subscribe and you'll see when I you know, have those posted. And I'll see you guys in the next video.